Welcome guys, this is Edwin, and today we are looking at my Bob Terzuola, not an Emerson, okay? This is my Bob Terzuola Eagle Rock, and don't worry, I still have a lot of Emersons to go through, so not a big deal, but today I wanted to show you this classic, classic piece. This is a full handmade custom by the legendary Bob Terzuola. It's probably from 2010, 2013, I'm not the sharpest guy in Bob's work, so if you have more information, feel free to let me know. But yeah, I think it's a 2010, 2013 based on my information. And again, guys, I have this piece for a long time now. I've been carrying no issues, and it's a full handmade custom by the man himself. If you don't know for whatever crazy reason who Bob Terzuola is, guys, He's a master knife maker and his history and career in the field is legendary, okay? The pioneer of the tactical folding knife and I highly recommend that you do two things. First, follow him on Instagram. If you have an Instagram account, he's always putting uh, backstage uh, processes. He's always showing off videos on, on his processes, you know, and all that. And it's always really cool to see from these master makers, right? And also go and listen to his interviews on different podcasts. The Night Junkie podcast, I highly recommend. And Mark of the Maker, he did several episodes as well. So check his interview. He talked through, you know, how he went into it and, and all the story, an open book. This guy, actually, he has a book. I think the title is The Tactical Folding Knife that he I bought his latest edition of it and it's very likely that he still have it available for purchase in his website. But again, let's talk about the Eagle Rock, a beautiful, beautiful knife that if you know my preferences, right, you can tell that this knife speaks to me a hundred percent. You have my Carta handles, titanium, bead blasted titanium bolsters, right? And then the steel on this is CPM 154, that like you know that whole 154 family of steels is one of my favorite, one of the reasons I love Ernest Emerson as well. So guys, let's look at this guy first. The Eagle Rock, it's a big knife. Let me do a couple of comparisons here with the classic CQC7 like we know. Let me make sure I show you that. It's a big knife, we're talking about a four inch blade Awesome, right? A 9.5 inches overall. So definitely in the big side right there. Let me see if I have that spider cut tenacious so you can take a look right here. That's how it compares, right? And one of the things with this knife in terms of how I compare with an Emerson and all that, I will tell you it really compare really well with the journeyman, right? You can see right here, okay? That's how it compares again. Two custom, two different monsters here, right? You got Ernest Emerson and Bob Terzuola on top, but this is kind of in that line of having that beautiful drop point, right? And then your micarta handles, big blasted titanium uh, bolsters that I do love. Let's look at that blade because the grind is a signature from Bob, this style of grind that you see right here. And it's just a beautiful, beautiful blade. I don't know how to call this satin finish that he does in this blade. You can see that beautiful switch right there. And guys, this right here is not a flat where you see that Terzuola logo. That's that's a grind right there. He's doing a grind. You can see it right here. He does that primary grind and then you have a secondary grind right there. And then you have your edge really really cool really different and again one of those signatures every time i see a knife like this it screams bob's design okay and you can see on the other side as well a beautiful beautiful drop point spear point style of design and again it's one of those designs that speaks to me perfectly thumb stud opening that is my preferred way okay you have that jimping right here on the top and again that thickness from this custom that is great great in the hand just like emerson customs right that thickness that feels like you're handling 
a great, great solid piece. I don't like thin knives on my hands, so that's one of those things I really, really enjoy. In terms of construction, you have your classic liner lock construction from Terzola. Beautiful, beautiful titanium bolster, micarta handles, and that clip that works really, really well. Let me give you some shots about that. And guys, I've been carrying this for a little while, on and off. You know, I have this knife probably several years, couple of years or so, and it's a beauty. I do love it. I should say this is my only Bob Terzuola design and very likely that I will be expanding a little bit my collection from him because definitely is a great, great user. And again, this is the model called Eagle Rock. If you have any question, comment about it and all that, feel free to, ju to jump in on YouTube. Of course, my Instagram is always there. And in caloblaze.com, I always have my information on the group that we're always hanging out and having a great time. Again, Bob Terzuola, legendary maker. You guys have a great, great day out there. Bye.